It's a treatment that may keep kids with cerebral palsy out of wheelchairs. It's bringing hope step by step to a Richland boy. Gene Ederson tells us how in today's King Five's Children's Health Link. So walk straight over there to Dad. Four year old Logan Ellingsworth is a fighter, but cerebral palsy made walking more and more difficult. So all the way up and then see if you can stay up there. His parents knew he might soon be wheelchair bound when they learned of a procedure at Seattle Children's. Can I see your back too? Committing to the surgery was hard. Logan would get worse before he could get better. In the surgery, we make a small incision. We take off the back uh, of one of the vertebrae, and that allows us to gain access to the spinal canal. The nerve roots that caused Logan's spasticity were permanently severed. He spent three weeks at Seattle Children's, followed by intense physical therapy at home. And that can last for six months to a year. But basically what they're doing is they're retraining the system, and uh, the results are unbelievable. Logan, Logan, Logan. Wow. Little man, you look fantastic. Dr. Susan Apcon led Logan's rehab team. She was amazed after just four months at Logan's progress. That were nice steps. big steps. Nice steps big are steps. My, much longer as he's yes, walking. He, yes. He's flatter on his feet. Yes. Logan has to continue daily physical therapy. He still uses braces and a walker. I'm going to hold this and I'm going to have you walk over to dad. But he's steadily gaining strength as he walks without them. See, to me, that's well, such an the improvement from where it was before. The procedure is not risk free, and the rehab is a huge commitment, said his mom. She had to overcome her own fear. You want them to go the longest distance they can with whatever it takes. Why don't you not use the walker, just come on back? And it's just amazing. I mean, to see him come in and walk down the hall, I mean, you can't ask for. A better day than that. And give me a high five because that is awesome. Dr. Brown hopes the surgery can replace a series of surgeries as a child grows up. I'm Jean Anderson for King Five Children's Health Link, linking you to better health.